Ah, there's nothing like a relaxing fire, a glass of raspberry iced tea, and just uh, a calming sunset to mark the end of a really long day. Hey, senpais, it's me, WG Deadman, and welcome to another uh, chatting with a dead man. This time, we're here on the fireside. Yes, this is my first ever fireside chat with the dead man. Um, I guess, actually, you know what, yes, I would believe that this is a update episode, well, not an episode, but this is an update video, um, regarding my first vlog that I made, uh, just Friday, um, regarding, uh, some thank yous and, you know, some issues and everything regarding that happened over this weekend, and, uh, first, let's, let's clear the white elephant out of the room. I know in that update, I said my mom was sick and something was wrong with her. I was fearing for the worst about what was going on. We just re- but, we recently just got a call, uh, back from her doctor and about her blood results. They came back negative. She is fine. She does not have cancer. She's cancer free. She is okay on that part. And I'm, I'm thinking, thank God for that because that is, I'm, I'm, I'm super happy for that. that she doesn't have that. That she's not, you know, she's not sick that way. And, you know, it's, it's great that she's, you know, that she's not, she's not, she doesn't have cancer. That's the best part. I'm so glad that she doesn't, and we can finally move on from that. She's perfectly fine. But the thing is, though, is that she's still feeling pain and pain right in that area of her stomach, with her flimbolis. And what are we gonna do about that? We honestly don't know. Um, the doctors have yet to know what's really wrong with her on that. But the person who got back the blood results, they're gonna call her doctor, get with her, and um. They are going to have a follow-up regarding about it, and we'll see what we have to do from there. Maybe we have to perform more surgery on my mother um, after since she just got her leg surgery. But everything is, with her, 100% healthy. She is fine on, on in the cancer department. She is just okay, and I am just super happy. And I'm just, I'm just happy that she's going to be okay. Um, although, I will say that Whatever we have to do next, I'm hoping it's nothing too serious, and I'm hoping it's going to be as little as little with pain or as pain as pain free as humanly possible. But you know, I'm I'm so glad that she's out of that. Now on the other end of things, the thank yous. This is a thank you to eight subscribers for this channel, and since I first started up just roughly a couple of weeks ago with these videos and everything. Um, I honestly cannot, I honestly did not know I would grow this fast as a starting up channel. That's not even affiliated with YouTube yet. I thought I'd maybe get, you know, one of you subscribers a month or so, or maybe every other couple of months, and, you know, it's just going to be that slow of a climb. But no, I got quite a few of you guys in my hand already, and I cannot thank you guys enough for that support. I'm, this is also a thank you for, you know, your comments and your messages regarding my mother's health. And I want to thank you guys from the bottom of my heart from that. I really thank you guys for the support. And I'm just so happy that I have a lot of you guys out there who show me support. And that's what all makes you my true senpais. And I, I cannot express my thanks enough. I love you guys. I love all of you. And I, all of you, we're, we're a huge, we're, we're a family. We're a small family, but we're a family. And I hope this family keeps growing. That, that I hope is a definite in the future. Um... It's <laughs> it's been a crazy weekend. Um, just it's just me sitting on my hands, knowing or not knowing what is wrong with my mother, and now knowing that she is okay. She doesn't have cancer. She it's fine. She doesn't have appendicitis, and I'm just glad that we can finally move on from that and find out what is truly wrong with my mother and what we can actually do to make her healthy once more. That's all I'm wanting for my mom. I'm just wanting to be happy, healthy, and just everything in between. I, I'm i very thankful for that. I'm thankful for you guys. Thankful for everything else. Um, what else did I have here on my agenda? Ah, yes. Um, video updates. I will be now going back to recording and uploading at a more at my more usual rate. I'll try to do two videos a day. Um, if not, you know, a few videos, you know, maybe a few videos, or maybe at least a video a day, 
at best. Um, I'm wanting to slow my series and stuff down just so I don't, you know, stop from wanting I have to work with. Um, but everything else with that, you know, the video department now, we're gonna crank out more videos. Just today, um, I did just upload some, uh, some, I, as I, as I promised, uh, Beyond Good and Evil HD Part 2. I know, as I said, after the last time I recorded and I uploaded that, I promised I would get Part 2, you know, here and there, so we can finally get to the actual nitty-gritty of things in the game. It is a truly remarkable game, and I'm so, and I'm actually glad that I finally got the equipment to record and, you know, play the game with it and enjoy it as, you know, as it should be enjoyed and as it should be shown, and I'm super excited that um, you guys are actually enjoying these videos. The view rates are actually going up um, as well, and I'm super excited for that. You guys are co just continuing with your support. You're continuing with your feedback, and I and I seriously thank you for that. Um, multiplayer collabs with me and Getsuka Tencho 86, aka Kelly the Man, aka soon to be uh, D's Gaming or D's Nuts Gaming, I believe. I think he's going to be going along those lines. But um, we may be doing more collabs. We're going to be doing Black Ops Zombies, a lot more of that. Believe me. Um, we may do some Call of Duty Black Ops multiplayer online, um, for that, for that matter. We may actually go back to that. Uh, we also are planning on showing off, uh, another, we're gonna be doing a collab of Games I Hate, or, um, should we call them Games We Hate, and I'm gonna, we're gonna be playing a little bit of Destiny. Not the second one, that, even though that's coming out next month, um, we're gonna be doing the first one, and... Yes, I hate Destiny, so does he, and we're going to break that motherfucker down like it has never been broken down before. It is going to be a bloody mess, and it's going to be fun making it a bloody mess. Um, part 3 of Killer is Dead should go out soon. I, I've had a little trouble, uh, I actually did have it fully ready and everything, but it didn't seem that when the video, my video editor was done compressing it, and converting it into an MP4 file instead of the original MOV files with all my add-ons and all my uh, my edits and my stuff in there. It didn't seem to have saved properly, but either way, I, I, I still have the raw video files on me. I'm still good on that department. I still have the thumbnail. And let me tell you, this part and this story and this chapter of I'm in the game... It got hard. I... I kinda... I got... I raged a little bit. Well, not... not totally raged. I got a little... You know, antsy with it, but I, I managed to come out on top just by the skin of my nose on that bit. <laughs> it was insane, but it was really fun because uh, we're finally learning more about the game and learning about Brian Mondo's past. It, well, not, but yeah, about his past, but we're just uncovering some things about his past, as well as what's going to happen next on in the game as well. And it's just, it's, it's super exciting to know that I can also play Killer is Dead because I've been wanting to play that game and I finally have the chance to do it and record it. And it's, it's great. I freaking love it. Killer is Dead is my first ever series on the channel and I want to keep on playing it as long as I can. Um, other than that though, oh, right. Starting next month, um, I, or either late, you know, late August of this month or, you know, just right at the start of September or, you know, really, really early September. I'm going to be starting a series on Mass Effect 3 and Mass Effect Andromeda. Those are the two favorite games of other series I love, and people are thinking, Mass Effect 3 and Mass Effect Andromeda? Why are you stupid? No, I just know what great games look like, and you, sir, are just the worst critic ever, because you obviously don't know what they look like. Either that, or you're just blind and stupid, whichever works. But yes, I will be playing those games when September or maybe maybe late August comes around. Whenever I get the time to go over those games and do a full series on that, I would love to. Um, as for the DLC, though, for Mass Effect 3, I don't think so. That That is too much DLC for me to even cover. So we won't see Samara... Uh, we won't see Drell. We won't see any of those guys, sadly. We're just gonna go with the original Mass Effect crew and all their glory. Um, and uh, it, it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be great. I will also maybe do a series on Dragon Age Origins, which I fucking love that game. I really love that game, and it is... Um, it's, it's, it's just something I've been wanting to do also. I have a lot to work with here, people. Believe me. This, my, my video rate in my channel, I don't see it fizzling away 
anytime soon. I really don't. And with your guys continuing su continuing the support, it's not gonna fade away, as far as I can tell. Uh, but yes, um, that is about it. Uh, oh, before I forget, I have it right here on my notes, right here on my iPad. Before I forget, um, I will be trying to cover a few games from the Xbox Live Creators Program. Um, I do have a couple of games ready for that. And expect those some... I expect a series, maybe a series, maybe a full playthrough um, in the not-so-distant future. I really can't say when. Um, I'll try to squeeze that in on my agenda and on my calendar to see what I can do with that. But um, other than that, though, people, with how my mom's health is, she's doing okay. With how this channel is going, fantastic. Good things are coming. Good things are so coming. And I'm... And I, and I welcome them. I welcome them here. And I hope you guys are going to enjoy them. Other than that, I believe that's about it. I really. <laughs> yes, that is about it. Double checking my notes. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to my first ever fireside chats. I hope you guys are all warm and toasty and relaxed and you know it's 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 been a monday it's it is a monday it's been one of those mondays and i'm just super glad that everything is okay everything turned out great for the greater good and we can finally move on to the bigger and better things and we can finally you know move on to go for the bigger fish to fry fish to fry not fresh fish that's a hard word for me to say apparently but yes, thank you guys so much for watching this video, and thank you guys so much for tuning in to just hear me out and hear me vent and rant and just hear some updates. Again, thank you guys so much for your support, and I will always be here if you guys want to talk. If you guys want to talk to me, let me know right down below in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, hit that like button, square on the nuzzle, and if you want to become a senpai today and help out this growing family, maybe, maybe, go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well. This is WG Deadman saying happy Monday, and I'll see you all on the flip side. Thank you for tuning in to Dead Man's Fireside Chat, and I'll see you next time.